All right, so this is a tour of a 2021 Freightliner Cascadia. A lot of people wonder what it's like inside of a semi truck. Well, I'll show you and explain everything. Keep in mind, it is a little bit messy because I'm getting ready to go home. So I'm packing up and cleaning and shuffling everything. So of course, got the driver's seat navigation. The newer dashboards are all digital. My ELD that tells me when and when I cannot drive. Of course, cup holders, three wonderful outlets to power all of my electronics. I keep all my shoes over here, and that's the trash that's waiting to go out. Then, got uh, all my cleaning and organization. Good old air gun. Got uh, storage space right here. Then the rag just fell out. Most important tool, CB radio. Storage right there. Just a whole bunch of shit up here I gotta clean out. Storage. Storage. And yeah, this is the front interior. Now we're gonna take you back where the magic happens. The good old Z-Zone, as I call it. First and foremost, a lot of these new trucks, this is used and abused, so it's all kind of fucked up. Uh but you have a giant fridge in here that holds quite a bit of stuff that'll just stay in there and um newer old drivers i use baby locks to actually keep it locked of course a little cabin here supplies and all my shit junk drawer basically basic bedding stripped down with uh with some foam Windows as you see Microwave hold it up here uh, These are notorious for failing these little Straps, so I've taped it down and I've learned to keep a bungee right there Because I've lost three microwaves otherwise forgetting to put them back You know food storage love rice uh, This pulls down and is the second bed, but uh, I keep it as storage food uh you know it's not all glorious behind this is uh what i call the shitter zone it's a shitter bucket because you never know where you're at or how far a rest stop is as a truck driver you can't always get to a spot all the controls for the bunk another uh light so we're gonna open this guy up right here hold on <sighs> And underneath, it's a little wonky because, you know, I keep all my water, my tools right there. My uh, chain side, because I don't have a chain rack, and it's winter, so I've been using them. There's my snow socks, there's everything I access for cleaning or doing fuel in case I need to use something for an emergency. And yeah, that's my wonderful little life. Oh, I almost forgot. Storage right here, keep coconut water, whatnot. We have inverters to power microwaves. So, yeah, these new trucks are quite luxurious. I'll do some more videos. Y'all take care.